be filled with formula. I'm using water just because I didn't want to waste any formula. But this bag will be all ready to go. And you have to be careful when you take it out of the refrigerator because it'll spill out because this doesn't have like a like a, cl a clamp or anything on it. It's just open. So you take the bag out of the refrigerator. You take it over to the pump. There's a little hole right there. You hang that onto the IV pole so that the bag is now hanging and the tubes roll on. Then what you're going to do is you're going to take this part. This is called the chamber. If you ever refer, if you ever hear me refer to it, this is a chamber. You put the chamber right there. You push it down all the way so it won't go anymore. Then this part right here, this part's stretchy. You take it and you stretch it around and this little black thing will sit right in there. And then you put this tube in there and then you throw it down. So it'll look like this. So the bag, it'll look like that. And then this part, you really don't want any tangles in it. And then this part, you really don't want any tangles in it. And then you will hook this red piece up to Cody's. You'll hook it up right here. You're going to hook it up just like that. Let me see if I can, there, like, just like that. Do not put this feeding tube in this, this port. That port goes to his stomach, and if you put the port in there, he's going to throw it up because he doesn't tolerate fluids in his stomach anymore. This port goes to his intestine. This port is just the balloon that keeps it in. That's how you deflate and, and inflate the balloon. So it goes in this tube. That's very, very, very important. Step in the pump. See how this is clamped? This, see, this is larger. It gets, like, thinner and thinner. This has to be pushed up. You just roll the ball up. Because if you don't, then the formula will not move through the tube, and it won't drip, and it won't sense it, and then you're going to get an, an uh, alarm. It's going to say error flow. The first time, like I said, sometimes you get that if the, well, you'll get that if the bag's empty, or if there's a kink in this or something. For some reason, it, it just can't flow. Something's clogging it. A lot of the time I'll forget to open this because I have it locked so that when it's in the refrigerator it doesn't leak out, but you have to undo that or else the formula can't flow. So that's real important that you undo the clamp. This is called the clamp in case I tell you on the phone or something. This is the clamp.